I just snorted milk. But guys, the moment we all have been waiting for, it is time for me to finally taste test G Fuel's Peach Cobbler. Yo, what's going on guys? My name's Ian Duffy, for those of you who don't know, and you guys smell that? That smells really good, hold on. Oh God, I hope it's not on fire. Dude, I completely forgot that I had something in the oven. Oh, whew, oven's off. What is it though? Sheesh. No way, G Fuel's peach cobbler flavor? Dude, let's definitely try this. <laughs> yeah guys, we're gonna be reviewing G Fuel's peach cobbler flavor. I hope you enjoyed that little skit there. I thought it'd be something kind of funny. Now I've actually never, ever, ever had peach cobbler. I have no idea what to expect from this. I haven't had an actual peach in years. It's been so long. I'm super stoked to try this flavor. Today's review, I will be trying it with milk and I will be posting another review shortly after that actually is the water review. Cause I know that a lot of people told me try it with with milk. I'm not really sure what to expect. The labeling is absolutely gorgeous. I love this design and I'm super stoked that I was able to get this. I'll be saying this in every video that includes stuff from the G Fuel Care package. So once again, thank you to Kingdom for sending me this absolute legend. Yeah guys, I'm super stoked. Let's get straight into this. Today's shaker, I will be using the Coral Floral Shaker. This is actually one of my favorite shakers and I put in, uh, I believe this is the Miami Nights, little ice separator thing. This time I'm actually not gonna be putting ice in. I know that's super weird. By the way, this shaker is so pretty, but I'm not going to be putting in ice for this review just because honestly, I just don't want it to end up watered down because I do plan on streaming after I film this review. So we fill it up all the way with milk, as you can see, and then we kind of just find that little perfect line. Just like the hype sauce, I think it's going to come off perfectly, and it does. Oh my goodness, I love that, dude. The moment everyone's been waiting for. Okay, so smell test of the powder real quick before we get any further into this video. Dude, it, oh my god. It smells like if Thanksgiving had a flavor. I'm definitely smelling the pie. Like, it smells like a cinnamon pie, and I can smell a hint of peach with it. I'm curious if the smell of this is gonna change after I put it in the milk or not. And I'm not sure if you guys can tell too well on camera, but that actually is more of a darker color, more of like a brownish. Uh, kind of kind of sandy, actually. It kind of reminds me of like beach sand. And once again, the scooper is up top because my luck is actually crazy. Just like with hype sauce i will be filling this up all the way to the top so i can get you guys a honest review of how the flavor is how it tastes because honestly because yeah i actually would rather have a strong flavor more than anything else it's actually turning into a kind of a really ugly yellow color in milk i'm curious if it's more orange in water it actually looks straight up like cinnamon the more i look at it and there we go finally it's all coming out you know what the best way to describe this like yellow is it reminds me of when the marshmallows melt in lucky charms we're gonna grab the top put that on real quick we don't want to get accident to happen so definitely making sure that's on tight i'm gonna shake this up real quick and we'll get right back to you guys all right guys so i did shake it up and it's a very uh white eggnog color it's it's not like perfectly white or anything but it definitely has a yellow hue to it definitely an eggnog color best way to describe this super duper stoked to try this flavor guys i actually can't smell anything at all oh my god I just snorted milk. Yeah, no, it definitely smells way more peachy in this. I still definitely have a cinnamon taste. But guys, the moment we all have been waiting for, it is time for me to finally taste test G Fuel's Peach Cobbler. Bro, this is actually so good. I really hope this doesn't disappoint in water. This is actually so good, dude. I'm gonna chill on enjoying the flavor real quick and explain to you guys what that actually tastes like. So my initial comments on the fact that it smells like cinnamon is definitely there. If G Fuel had a cinnamon flavor, this would be it. Once again, like I said, I have no idea what a peach cobbler tastes like. So my correlation to anything else is pretty poor, which I guess can help you guys out who also have never had peach cobbler. Literally, it tastes like pie crust with cinnamon on it. And then it has a very like small fruity kick to it that makes it super smooth and go down really well. Fun fact, by the way, guys, if you don't like that powdery taste and you're drinking anything such as moon pie, peach cobbler, strawberry shortcake, strawberry banana, all those flavors can go in milk and the thickness of the milk will actually take out the powdery taste if you guys ever experience that. Now, normally when people tell me that, I just tell them to shake it up more. I've never really had something that's too powdery and that's coming from someone who puts extra powder in their G Fuel. So yeah, guys, that flavor actually is so good. That definitely caught me off guard and it really does give me a warm 
warm feeling inside that I can easily correlate to the holiday Thanksgiving. Like it literally just kind of gives you a nice warm feeling inside. I'm curious what that would taste like warm. I don't know if you guys have ever had that like warm eggnog or warm milk. I'm curious if that will taste better with warm milk. Honestly, like I'm very curious. If you guys want to see that, I will actually do another review of the peach cobbler with warm milk. If we can get this video to 30 likes, I know that's crazy. 30 likes and I'll do this with warm milk. Overall, this flavor honestly took me by complete surprise and I'm gonna have to give this at like a 9.2. This actually is a really good flavor and so far with me only trying a milk, that is my current standpoint on it. The water review may be a little different. I'm not sure what to expect from that one yet, but if you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure you drop a like on it, subscribe to the channel if you are new, and turn on the bell to so get notified whenever I upload. Guys, you're gonna be seeing a lot more G Fuel content around here lately until we get some banging vlogs up for you guys. Don't worry, also working on that. Yeah, guys, get excited. If you guys do enjoy what I'm wearing, make sure you guys keep your eyes peeled on Front's new merch drop. It is called the Fear Collection. Yeah, it's super sick, guys. Super nice quality. We actually killed it this time around and the designer killed it with the designs and so forth. Tons of varieties. I have a windbreaker somewhere over there in my room. Yeah, make sure you guys use code FRONT on all your G Fuel Energy purchases until we can make code Duffy happen, baby. And make sure you also use code FRONT on your Armor GG purchases. Thank you all for watching. I love you all. Peace.